All right, guys, welcome back. Episode 192 of this uh, sub the subscriber dynasty. I was gonna spit that out eventually. It's been a long weekend. <laughs> um, I had a bye week, so no gameplay footage for me. If you want to see some, make sure you check out the Italian. He's got some for this week. So I'm not going to show his score, but you could check out and see some gameplay footage because it's going to be the only way you're going to get it. I think Mark, who is North Carolina, he said he's getting a uh, recording software, so he might be able to live stream some of his games. So make sure you check out his his YouTube channel. It's down in the description as well. As far as I know, those are the only two guys that record and or live stream. So if you want to keep up with anybody else in the Dynasty, make sure you go check out those guys. So see what everybody else did this week. North Carolina had a bye week. Louisville had a bye week. West Virginia Oh, ho, ho, ho. I'm ready to see the stats for that one. Ends up winning by one point, 35-34. This was a national championship last year. That's why I scheduled it. Interested to see what happened there. Because typically with that, maybe Pride Aid Leader went for the win. with his two-point conversion, didn't get it. Um, interested to see how that game plays out. Missouri ended up not getting his game in. I'm going to show the image on the screen. He had that bunch glitch where the line just all sticks together. He couldn't play his game. So hopefully he gets the win because that kind of glitch has happened to... I know Merck's had it happen to him. Um, little Stud has had it happen to him. He's had it happen to him. It's like happened to a lot of people in Dynasty. I've yet to experience it, so I'm not sure what the deal is there, but it's a ridiculous glitch, and hopefully they get it fixed because uh, if he loses, that's going to suck. It really is. So their miss ends up winning his first game in the Dynasty, 24-21. K-State ends up losing 47-7 against a tough Michigan team. Mid-Tennessee State ends up losing 33-21. We saw the Stanford game uh, loses a nail-biter. LSU ends up winning 34-21. Packers Rogers wins 49-3. If you want to see the Italians game, make sure you go check out his channel. Link's down in the description. And see what's going on there. So we're going to advance it real quick, see what's happening in the top 25, and we'll be right back. All right, just getting on with the advance. I play against Southern Miss this week. The new guy, SBGG MLP. I figured, hey, welcome to the Dynasty. Let's play the Kamish. <laughs> um, he's already won his first game, so he's got a, a game under his belt. And we'll see uh, how we do. Hopefully we get the win. I'm looking looking forward to playing them. Like I do all the users looking forward to see their play style and how they play. Especially with new people. Because um, I'm kind of at a disadvantage in a way. Because I have a whole bunch of videos to see my play style. Whereas I have no idea how he plays. So hopefully hopefully we come out and get the win. If not, it's, it's, uh, it's acceptable. <laughs> well, it'll have to do. I mean, it's not acceptable. I won't have a choice about it. North Carolina plays Tennessee. Oh, snap. First user game for these guys of the season. Interested to see how that game turns out. Louisville plays Stanford. West Virginia plays Nebraska. Missouri ended up losing. Wow, that freaking sucks, dude. On a glitch. I'd be so mad. Ends up losing. Potentially ruins his entire season because of that. But he's got a bye week this week. I play Southern Miss. K-State has a bye week. Mid-Tennessee State has a bye week. Stanford plays Louisville. LSU's got a bye week. Florida plays Georgia. And Tennessee plays North Carolina. Check out top 25 real quick. See if anything really changed after week one. I mean, a little bit, but not a whole lot. One, two, three, stay the same. Four, five, four and five, both lost. Interesting. So Nebraska and Missouri, because stupid glitch. So he ends up dropping. Um, Tennessee moves up pretty good. And Tennessee State drops a little bit, but still in the ranking. Anybody close? Not really. Florida's ranked now. So we got quite a bit of people in the top 25. Oh man, I meant to show the the like pre preseason stuff. My bad. I completely forgot about that. Whoops. Heisman watch. We can at least do that. <laughs> um, Nebraska, of course, on top, and then my quarterback at LSU's quarterback. So hopefully we can get the Heisman. That'd be cool. My quarterback is legit for a sophomore. Very happy about that. But I did I did forget to to show preseason All Americans and potential Heisman winner or Heisman watch. At the start and conference lookouts, um, I, I do apologize for that. That's my my bad. I meant to do that before we advanced it, so I'm sorry. I <laughs> I, I I missed. I messed up. My bad. It happens. Every now and then it happens. So we are into week two. Uh, we got some gameplay footage for this next week. That's gonna be it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see y'all next time.